Would you be okay with your partner having an OnlyFans? Yeah, it's gonna be an interesting one. How people see their partners and their bodies and sharing their bodies is a widely contentious thing, but is there a point where it gets too far? Well, we're about to find out. So I invited a couple friends here and presented them with a scenario dealing with OnlyFans and gauge if the person in the scenario was wrong for what they did. Now let's see what conclusions they and y'all come up with. So, yo, I have uh, brought you three here uh, to, to gauge uh, some people uh, and see if they're in the right or in the wrong. It's dealing with OnlyFans mm. and I brought some only fans experts ah, i feel like i'm probably, a it's not. <laughs> oh, it was like ah <laughs> so mean. Uh, oh whoa what no, I'm just kidding. No, no, no. <laughs> i don't think they know anything about only fans but i feel like stanley could have like four subscriptions Yo, in the back saying, bro there's been <laughs> some late nights hey, yikes <laughs> i play please i, I just want to support the adult industry this is gonna be a long episode <laughs> okay all right so how this will work is i'm gonna give y'all a prompt Okay, and you guys are going to say if that person is in the wrong or if they're in the right. And uh, we'll see, and then we'll see what this, how this okay. goes. So the title is, am I wrong for not wanting my girlfriend to have an OnlyFans account? I already agree with bro. Let's wow. wrap it up. Right, let's wrap up gotta, the show. Let me, let me get there first before you just start. Yo, hold on, yo hold on, I thought hold on. I thought these I thought these questions were gonna be difficult. Yeah, I thought it was gonna <laughs> be hard. Oh my god! <laughs> all right, all right, wow, hold everyone on. sounds like right. they know for sure. But, but wait, we get, let me explain. Let me let me read this out. So me, male eighteen, and my girlfriend, female eighteen, have been in an on and off relationship for almost two years. It was rough a few months ago, but as of recently, things have been going great. We were talking late last night and she brought up the topic of OnlyFans. This was something that we had talked about before when things were rough between us and it was something I never felt comfortable with. She brought it up saying she was highly considering starting up an OnlyFans account. She said it's an easy way to make good money and she wouldn't be showing her face at all or even posting nudes. All the pictures would either be lewd uh, or cute slash attractive outfits. I personally don't feel comfortable with the idea of her body being out on the internet for people to buy pictures of. I completely understand and support the idea of your body, your choice, but I feel like my opinion should be taken into consideration. I strongly disagree against her doing so and to the point where I would feel very uncomfortable and insecure as any time I get pictures from her, it wouldn't be as special or knowing that I'm not the only one who gets to see her that way. I'm also just a very insecure person and that also bothers me as I'm not good enough. Even after what I said, she still that she wants to do so off of some information she found on a video changing her mind about it am i wrong for not wanting her to do it? how down bad is no. like how, they have to be broke for her to like oh piece of hiring bro like <laughs> that's what i'm saying because he's at rough times it just sounds like bro needs some money bro like that's how she sounds. so first before we before we get into it let me get everyone's initial thought. Like, what's your initial yes or no? Is, is he wrong? So first I'll start with Hono. No, I, I don't think he's wrong at all. I mean, his feelings are valid. That's my first um, thought about it. I, but did she say like they were tight on money? Like she absolutely needs it and OnlyFans is the only option? Right, like go to the Dollar General. She said it was the easy way of good money and, and that she wouldn't be doing a whole yeah, lot. Yeah, cause he said like they, she only mentioned it when they were going through those rough times. Okay. Um, so Stanley, what do you, what do you, what do you say? I think the better question is, is it okay to use your girlfriend to get out of a financial situation? <laughs> like if you down bad, Whoa. it's like, all right, babe, <laughs> look, Whoa. you might have to throw so, some cheeks on the only So thing. I'm guessing, so I'm guessing your answer is, uh, is fine. Yeah, he's not wrong. He's, he's completely valid. He's for sure completely valid mm -hmm. uh, and feeling the way that he feels. Okay. Okay. Uh, Tyler. He's okay in feeling the way he feels. And I'm just thinking about this realistically, right? Mm -hmm. It's thousands of OnlyFans. Okay. What's gonna make her think that she go be able to make money like no a lot cap. of money? No. Like, <laughs> like cap, only OnlyFans. No OnlyFans no is the new SoundCloud rapper. Like, no. what if no, she? What if she end up just selling other, like fifteen? No, I fifteen dollars a month. SoundCloud and OnlyFans are two completely <laughs> different oh, industries. Oh, bro, oh. everybody trying to come up off of OnlyFans. She got competition. I, well, who I knows? believe Maybe she's just really hot and she pops off. Bro, what she if that could happens? be mad hot, bro. I I feel like there's a lot more people on OnlyFans <laughs> like, making bang. And she was really hot when she be with a guy who was struggling with. Like, Ooh. Bro, whoa. Ooh. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> right now. Ooh. Personally, I agree with y'all in that. 
it's fine how he feels is how he feels and how your boundaries are are set but i also don't think she's wrong for starting only and she wants to start only fans she can start only fans in my personal I, opinion right. i agree if she want to go get one she could go get but he's reasonable to think yo i might i'm not really feeling it so then i have a second question for you guys okay if he were to break up with her is that is that valid she made it so in this example like he would she would have made it she made the only fans and then he broke up with her oh yeah for sure for sure i'm out like if <laughs> like wow. like it seems it seems selfish That's... but it's like you want to get my wishes but the... like hold on hold on hold on got a face hold on i'm conflicted because it would be selfish of me to be like you, you shouldn't do this because how i feel and i'm not considering how she feels but at the end of the day even though it's like sex work and stuff is normalized today, it's just so extreme for my girl to be doing that. Uh, I mean, hey, man. Wait, wait, hold on. What are you <laughs> been like mm, for a while? I got to hear this. I'm like trying to think okay. of the situation because um, mm, obviously okay. if she makes the OnlyFans and they discuss that they both or that he was uncomfortable with it and she still went ahead and did it, then I think like it'd be valid enough for him to be like, okay, yo, like I'm not comfortable with you yeah. doing that. I'm not comfortable with myself and I want to, yeah. you know, leave. But, but like, I'm trying to think if he leaves her, what kind of financial situation is she in now? Like, is she okay <laughs> now? Like, because well, she's- I mean, the only fans can pop off, oh. yo. I who know. <laughs> Could. Could. Oh. There is a chance. I think it's a lot simpler than that. It's like if there's a boundary in a relationship and then mm. like it's said and talked upon and then like somebody, you know, goes past or exceeds that, then that's grounds for like breaking up. So like it'll, it'll mm. be fun. Like you could put anything in that example. Yeah, I agree. For mm. one, I feel like me personally, if my girl wanted to make an OnlyFans, I'd be cool with it personally. I know that's a, a point of contention. Ooh, yeah. But but if you aren't comfortable with it, I think you're valid if you don't want to be with someone. I don't think you're being selfish. I think that's how you feel, especially if you're right. just insecure. Exactly. And he's really upfront about that, his insecurity. Yeah, yeah. so I, I do think it's kind of wild that, like, how, how maybe she would just not consider his feelings, but she's also allowed to do make that OnlyFans, in my opinion. Wow. So, so in truth, I don't think he's not in the wrong, and I don't think she's in the wrong either. If she wants to make an OnlyFans, she can make an OnlyFans. Me personally, I think we should be making that bread together. Girl, post them feet pics. <laughs> no, Kurt. Girl, post them no. feet pics. Let's get this bread. I I want Let's to be her OnlyFans. Be your only fan. I'll still be your only man. Uh, it's just oh. be like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, the bars. Kate, I. I have no rebuttal. Yeah. So I mean, that's how I feel. So would you wait? So then would y'all feel way if y'all girl had a or guy had a had a OnlyFans? My guy had no. it. Yo, 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 the guy only fans by Puff. I don't think <laughs> Yo, yo, that's I don't think they go it's... crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh yo, my how? gosh. I I wanna say I'd be supportive of it because they were both getting that bread, but but knowing that my man's pictures are in another girl's phone, I don't know. You, you I don't wanna... know. You want me to make it more uncomfortable? You know, like how when you start like a YouTube channel, the first the first people to support you are your immediate friend group. So like, if you start an OnlyFans, you're like, oh, I made an OnlyFans. The first people who are gonna see it are the immediate. If my group. girl makes an OnlyFans and the first people to support are the homies, bro, your homies I'm... is gonna be on her OnlyFans page 100%. You, YouTube is different than OnlyFans though. Why yeah, you, that's what I'm why, saying. Why would you? <laughs> Send your OnlyFans to your friend group. I don't know. They're both social media platforms. Stanley, why you sending your girl's so OnlyFans to the <laughs> they go Hey, yo, go support my girl. Okay. I'm a very supportive <laughs> person. <laughs> <I know. laughs> Shut up. <laughs> oh, no. They go find out, bro. I'm telling the main, you. The reason I say no is because the main fear I have is my girl's OnlyFans not popping off. Cause then it's like <laughs> that's the main fear. It's like, the it's main like, fear. It's like it's, the primary fear. No, nobody. You you really connect this to SoundCloud rappers, huh? And then if it does too well, I'm like, <laughs> ooh. So it's a problem would, either way. I'm kind of I'm kind of with Tyler though. I'm like I I I feel it though. I don't really want it to pop off like that. But then you said you're okay with it. So so you you, you told your girl that it's okay, and then she yeah. starts to pop off. Then what you're gonna tell her like? I'm and not. Then, I'm gonna be like, nah, this on me. I f up. <laughs> 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 no, I would feel. I would feel ways, but I do. I, I don't know. I'm pretty keen on like. I want to make sure she feels that she can do what she wants, and she could feel her independence as she may. 
Uh, okay. So although it would make me feel a little bit uncomfortable, I would assume that I'd pick a loyal enough girl that at the end of the day, you're coming back to me. You're not going to be in these DMs uh, giving dick ratings or whatever. You know what I mean? So uh, <laughs> I, I'm assuming that everything. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Which is a thing, apparently. Actually, <laughs> if she wanted to do ratings, right, instead of the OnlyFans, Let's get them ratings off. I'll, I agree. I'll do the dick ratings. <laughs> I agree. With that. There's, if there's a way we could just finesse by getting by with ratings, bro. Yep. Hey, <laughs> like, I'll help you. Like, well, what if it's like, I, I don't know if OnlyFans subscribers do this, but what if they were asking for like like socks from your girl or like underwear? Like totally fine. Underwear? Totally, totally fine. fine. We are, we totally are fine. finessing. That's just merch. merch. That's just merch. merch. I am fine with that. <laughs> if we can get the socks and bath water off mm -hmm. it's wraps we can do bath water because bath water. now she's not just on only fans she's a brand okay and i respect the ceo so let's say everyone if uh if can a booty pick is a booty pick too much a booty pick from my man <laughs> bro there's some nice guy butts out there yo Dude, you how, you right. how much is her only fans a month good question oh you're getting the logistics of it yeah five five ninety nine a month five ninety nine for a booty pick bro come on she got to market herself better, bro. <laughs> like nude you booty at least all the bro, yeah, nude bro, booty. Bro, five ninety nine plus you got to do discount sometime. Like, that's cheap. Yo, that's so cheap, you're bro. so you're okay you with it if she bumps up the price. Yeah, value yourself. Oh, Come on. Value yourself. <laughs> I didn't know y'all were businessmen like this. Oh How God. do you like put a price on a booty? How much would it be? Then? You tell me, Hono. How do we put a bro? What's the price? I'm not uploading what a booty pic for less than twenty dollars a month. Twenty dollars. The <laughs> upload, You have the nicest if ass. <laughs> <laughs> Toned and chiseled. Twenty dollars a month for one picture. I'm like, yo, that shit. Your oh, ass look like picture? handsome Squidward. Yeah, it looks <laughs> like handsome Squidward face. Now, while OnlyFans is a site where you can become a bit more hornier, let me tell you about a site where you can get a bit more smarter. Yes, I am indeed undefeated with these transitions, and this video is brought to you by Skillshare. You didn't already know, Skillshare is an online learning community that gives you membership with meaning, giving you access to a myriad of classes that let you dive deep and discover your passions outside of uh, horniness. At least I am pretty sure did not go that deep in the site. Oh man. From art to editing to productivity skills, Skillshare really has it all for anyone. Now me personally, I've been using Skillshare for years and it's really helped me improve my craft, like genuinely. I've been continually watching Learn to Storyboard by Leo Matsuda. So these videos can have the funny direction with the art you see today. Like especially with the last video, I was very proud with how I've been setting up stuff for the artists and, uh, and especially with a new one that's coming up, I'm really excited. So yeah, and I gotta owe that all to Skillshare. So if you want a chance to dive into your passions, and for free yo click the link in the description for a free trial of skillshare premium but you better be quick because only the first 1000 people do it will get it so once again if you want skillshare premium for free click that link in the description and fast and get to learning with thousands of others with skillshare thank you skillshare for sponsoring this video oh what's up y'all yo thank you very much for checking out that last video um it was pretty fun and i gotta give a lot of love to uh hono bread stanley animations and tyler relief for pulling up uh you can check out their links in the description below um but other than that i don't really have much else to say this one's kind of a, a short outro i really don't think i have anything else to say uh, except uh, if you like this video please check out the last one and if you like the channel feel free to support me on patreon those are the real ones right there um i really appreciate y'all from the bottom of my heart um but yeah and, and sorry for the super late upload i've been like blah lately but i'm getting back on the horse all right so we'll we'll be all right uh, so give me some time i'm slowly going to start easing into it um but yeah it's all um but that's really about it um i guess i'll catch y'all next time in the next video it's been fun adios